This part was brought to you by PK Gam Enterprises, PK Gam International, PK Gam Productions, and also PK Gam. Yeah, hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. I lost the entire progress I made last part because I forgot the save state, so I had to redo the last couple stages before I made this part. So some of the numbers are gonna be wrong, but eh, whatever, I can deal with it. <laughs> it's fine, it doesn't really make much of a difference overall in this walkthrough. Let's start the next world, Mechanos, with Fireball Frenzy. So we're going to be introduced to a new critter here. Look at that. It's an owl with a gun known as t a carbine. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's kind of a weird enemy and it's in the background so you can't really do anything about it. But, the, oh, there's a bear coin there. But, <laughs> but there is some rather interesting situations that that critter makes in this level because that's, it's the entire gimmick of the level, I guess you could say. Oh, and there's lava too. So uh, beware of that because lava hurts. It's it's hot. It would burn your fur right off. If you have never heard of lava before, now you have. Oh, and this is this is also kind of weird. Watch this. Oh, come on, come over here. Come on. I just wanted to fall off the edge and go. I keep despawning it. Dang it. I want it to fall in the lava. Oh, it doesn't go off the edge. Oh well. There. I want to show something though regarding that. Well. <laughs> It, it's weird, those critters do not, or should say, are not harmed by the lava, they just walk right on top of it. <laughs> I probably could have showed that off with the uh, um, first bristle that we've seen, but uh, yeah. I guess I'll uh, take another pass through this level, you know, to show that off once I'm done with this. Just do not take hits, remember, you're playing the special toughest code version of the game here, so... Oh yeah, you might need both Kongs, you might not. You never know until you get to the point you need. Uh, what the heck is this machine? Like, is this a furnace? But if so, why is there two entrances to it? Or maybe this is two different machines, but what's this gear for in the center and... Oh, forget it. Uh, I'm probably thinking about it too much. <laughs> anyway, oh shoot! You're shooting a lot faster than the other ones, aren't you? Oh yeah, I forgot that they actually do increase their firing rate. Uh, as you go, and I want to get up here because there's something we need to get to over here, yeah. There's lava below, so you don't want to jump into it, that's why I was very careful with my jumps there. And yeah, anyway, let's bash the baddies with a new buddy known as Squitter. Well, actually, you should know it from, uh, um, I was going to say Super Mario Brothers 2 for a second there, but no, it's from Donkey Kong Country 2. You can shoot webs with the Y button um, and move around, you know, jump like you usually do with the regular characters, but you can also make platforms like that by hitting the uh, A button and then hitting the A button again while the uh, web is in midair, and you can make a platform out of it. And that's the spot where we would have came from if we could... Well, actually, I could show that off, couldn't I? Because I can do this. <laughs> yeah, I'm just going to go backtrack. Oh, jeez, those webs sometimes disappear randomly, too. Uh, yeah, this is the spot where we jump to uh, to get to that bonus barrel. See, that's why I had to avoid the lava uh, down below. Anyway, I still want to keep both Kongs if I can help it. So, yeah. Uh, maybe I should actually have Dixie for this. She's way better for this level than Kitty Kong is. Because <laughs> she's got the helicopter spin. Oh, this platform. I love this. Look at this. Look at this setup. <laughs> Gotta avoid the shots while you're going up the elevator. That is awesome. Okay. This, I think, is the spot where we need both Kongs. So I better do this right. Okay, safe. Oh, wait, where am I? I don't know. Oh, get, okay. <laughs> yes. 15 bananas. Can I do it? Oh, God, no. I'm switching Dixie. <laughs> She's much, much smaller for this. Pick your battles, don't get all the bananas that you see, you have plenty of time to get them. Just take them when you can. Don't risk your fur. <laughs> Just be careful. Just get very cautiously, you don't want to risk having to do that toss again, because that toss isn't very user friendly. <laughs> oh, I got it, I got it. I got it. 
Okay. <laughs> I still would prefer not to take any hits, if at all possible, because I don't know if there's any more bonuses in this level. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, I think, if I'm correct, those shots mess with your kegs. Let's just see for the for kicks. Oh, I guess I can't see. Oh, well, maybe I can see. Hold on. I just want to see if I can time this to hit one of those. Uh, it's actually harder to hit one than it is for, for it to be hit by the barrel. <laughs> Right, that's just there to hinder you. Yep, it does stop your kegs. But uh, yeah, I guess that's more just to hinder you from being able to get the keg easily. Because it would um, it would knock it out of whoever's hands are holding it. Or, you know, stop whoever's from holding it. Because you'll take a hit from it. Anyway, moving on. No, 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 no. Yes. <laughs> just gotta watch the pattern and then time yourself with them. And now they're, as you see, they also move with you they don't just like stay in one spot they actually follow you around the level but you've already know us already <laughs> okay i got the g that means i'm near the end of the level Ooh, oh, ooh. okay i'm safe i think did i get everything i think i did i did <sighs> that was a pretty good run <laughs> next one bazooka's barracks not really a stage, but you know, it's Bazooka. This guy, Morgan Kong's Brigadier Bazooka here. All present and correct, I see. Marvelous. I fought in the Kremlin War, don't you know? But I've retired from the service, along with Big Bessie. Who is Big Bessie? She's the biggest and greatest cannon of all time. What a beauty! Hmm. <laughs> you wanna know, you wanna use my cannon, Young Kongs? Not without some sort of ammo, I'm afraid. What ammo might we need? Well, we're gonna have to find out later when we do the trading sequence. For now, let's go over to Demolition Drain Pipe. This is a very mean stage, especially with the toughest code activated because there's no midpoint. It's a minecart level, and you can jump down off of those tracks at the top of the screen there by holding down and hitting the jump button like so. And you will most likely need to do that to avoid stuff along the way because you will be destroyed by all the obstacles that will be bugging you the whole time, bonus barrel. Yeah! I will bash those baddies. Oh, and yes, you can, as you can tell, you can jump off of all the critters that you see along the way because this cart, minecart thing, whatever, it, it looks more like a sled actually. It's pretty much gives you invulnerability when you jump on stuff, but if ugh, but if you run into stuff like walls, or like those things, or fall into a hole and hit a wall, that's not gonna be pretty for you. <laughs> Just gonna tell you that. Oh, what? Whoa, 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 I, I jumped on you. No. No, 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 no. You can't tell me I didn't jump on you. I was above you, and I was landing down. I call foul play on that one. <laughs> well, anyway, I think if I was playing this on the uh, regular version of the game without the toughest code activated, I would have a midpoint by now. I mean, by that by that point. So, oh, did I want to do that? Maybe not. <laughs> I just kind of went by instinct there. Bloop. I just have to, I guess I'll finish this and do this bonus twice. <laughs> <laughs> and, and as you see, you don't really have much uh, room for error there because uh, what happens when you go in there is if you pass something, you can't go back because this is like a mock auto scroll sta stage of sorts. You gotta time your jumps and movements to face off against whatever obstacles are coming along the uh, along the way. And that's that same um, passing that I took a hit from the last time. <laughs> <laughs> Except this time I took it from the higher buzz from instead of the lower one. Now you switch a kitty Kong. I don't know if it makes a difference in terms of the hitbox, but it might. So I'm gonna use him first and save Dixie for the tighter areas, you know, in case I do take a hit or something like that. Uh, this stage, though, <laughs> it's another one of those high ramp ups of of difficulty, as you might have guessed, because you haven't faced any sort of stage like this thus far, so. You've got your work cut out for you here. <laughs> anyway, we are moving. We are grooving. Oh, made it this time. S seriously, what the heck is that? <laughs> I can't believe... I mean, maybe it's because I'm hitting it with the back of the sled and it, it doesn't count if I hit it there or something. Oh, no, you should also be watching the uh, right side of the screen, too. That's... Uh, 
that's another factor you should be paying attention to because I don't know if I want to go up there or what because the camera just zoomed up. I'm so scared. Oh no! And I was so close to the end because there's the G. A formidable stage indeed. I'm gonna resume here at the letter N because that's where things started getting dicey. <laughs> Uh, I'm still looking for another bonus area if one exists some mm, I, I still feel that like there's something up there. Maybe I'm supposed to jump up into that hole To find ah, I died the same way there to find something that is up there Because the camera as you've seen it pans upwards when I reach that spot So that usually means they're hinting at something and actually I should have kitty whoops Oh yeah, I forgot that's there as well to uh, prevent you from not using that um, uh, sled here. They thought of everything. Oh yes. <laughs> Alright, back at the letter N. This time I'm going to try and jump up into that hole when I'm able to get in, uh, get back to the top road here. <sighs> not here. Here. Now I'm going to go. I, whoa, 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 whoa. I, I can't jump there? What? Hmm, I can't jump up off the railing. Interesting. Huh. Anyway, I'm coming to the oh boy! Coming to the end of the stage. Maybe that was all the bonus areas? And there was, you know, there was only one? Oh, shoot. I need to get yeah, up over here. Oh, come on. <laughs> By the way, uh, I should actually show you this. Uh, you can't actually go back once you get to this point. Yep. Designers thought of everything. <laughs> Alright. Oh yeah, got it. Now. Now. Bloop. Nope, didn't get everything. Dang it. Now, where the poop is the scoop? <laughs> I don't know. I'll look. Letter N. Here we are. Alright, so... Where is the bonus area? Because I'm pretty sure one is around here somewhere. Hmm. I don't know. I really don't know. Aw, oh, foopers. <laughs> Letter N. You are a good marker. But anyway, I, oh, I, I think I'm going to take a different route this time through that area because clearly I'm not getting any results on the higher route like I thought. Banana! Banana! <laughs> Yeah, okay. Do I have to get all the stars? I hope not. I really hope, I really do have to get all the stars. Oh my god, and I can't restart that without having to redo the whole stage, right? That's what I thought. Good lord. <laughs> That's going to take me some practice. Duh. <laughs> Duh. Oh, sure, it works there, huh? Oh, dang it. I got sucked on the top rope. Ha! 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 Not this time. Alright, here we go. Gotta watch ahead. Watch ahead. Oh, oh, oh! Alright, did I get everything now? Start select? Yes, I did. <laughs> and with that, I'm going to end off this part here because this went on for quite a while. <laughs> so I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next part.